This is from my first modeling job. I don't think I've changed that much. Been in the game for a minute, guys. <laughs> Growing up, I was as enthusiastic about life as I am now. I was always curious. I love finding weave on the floor. I feel like it's like finding a penny. <laughs> it's good luck. <laughs> Do I see myself as part of the change within the fashion industry? Yes. I never want to conform. I want to break all the rules. Conforming, I know that that's not going to make me happy. We're on Ridley Road right now, and the sun feels so good on my face. If anybody's looking for me, if they come here, they can find me. <laughs> one pound, guys, one pound. People always give Dalston such a hard time, but there is a huge community here that give it such a special energy. Oh no, it's on video. Community is how I value my life. That's priceless. What are the questions I've had to ask myself and how have they shaped the person I am? In terms of my career, the way I was doing it wasn't working for me. I was a skinny, skinny model for a long time. and There wasn't room for me. I came back to it and found a way to work at my size so I could truly be myself. The most exciting thing about fashion right now is the fact that casting is changing. Finally! Who are the women that influenced me? when I was taking part in the chain. Your turn now, Margie, passing the phone on to you. Thank you. <laughs> With it being handed over across so many different amazing women's lives, it's really beautiful to see how they live, like the little things that make us tick, the moments, the pauses. They're the moments that make up who we are. <laughs> it's hard to make anything different work. It's a privilege to be able to just go to work and get to be myself, because for so long it wasn't like that and seeing someone be their true selves is the most beautiful thing about life.